So first of all, hi Kitty, welcome to Bollywood Bubble. How are you doing? I'm doing very well. How are you? All well. Also, so now that we have a chance to talk to you, I'm going to also talk about your relationship with food today. Okay. So I'm going to ask you certain questions related to food. Let's see how you answer them and how honest you are. So you know, first question. There are there's several diets that I've come across and read off, like that food diet and this keto. Is there anything that you put your hands on and never tried on? Uh, see, I tried doing keto for like. I I mean it was a nine day course and I gave up on the first day itself. <laughs> so I really I don't think it is something that I will ever be able to do. Um, but I I did this diet called intermittent fasting, uh, which has really helped me. Um, I and I also find it quite easy to do. So um, intermittent fasting is something that I've done and it's worked well on my body. But again, it totally depends on body to body. Like some people are very very um, happy with keto as well. Like I have a few friends who lost. Weight and who've toned their body because of keto. So it totally depends. And usually, so intermittent fasting is something that I do um, like once a month. Usually, the diet that I basically follow is just to like give up on uh, carbs and sugar and just have like healthy. Give up on junk food in general. So that's something that I. Hmm. If you had to kind of you know rush to something, uh, if it's your cheat meal day, what is it that you would put your hands on? Subse pehle. If it's a cheat meal day, oh, so uh, the first thing that I would have is pani puri. Like I'm a huge pani puri maniac, so I'd go to like any good pani puri. So the Sharma Ji's in Juhu, unka pani puri is the best. So I would go there, and then later it would follow. So I'm a huge foodie, so I can eat anything any day. Oh my God! I can tell you, pani puri eight months, no six months. I waited for it during the lockdown. I've made myself a banana bread. रेस्टोरेंट <laughs> 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 My favorite cuisine is actually uh, Chinese food. I can have Chinese food as much. I mean, I can have chili chicken and uh, noodles and stuff like that. So Chinese from mainland China is the best. Like I've had uh, like some really good experiences there. Or um, restaurants. So, I mean, I have no idea. Like small, small cafes where you can get good food. I am just like exploring. Ooh. Okay. Tell me, what's the weirdest thing that you've ever had? Hmm. The weirdest thing I've ever had. So the thing is that I'm a per- I can't risk food. If I find something weird, I will not have it. So my that problem is that I don't explore it. I don't risk it. So as hmm. a weird, so I've never had anything like that. But I find the actually nothing. It's very. I should start uh, exploring. <laughs> This question has made me realize that I should start exploring. I've never had anything weird. Okay. Also, you know, there are some girls. I won't say all, but some females, you know, who get very cranky and they tend to have mood swings when they don't get their food on time. Are you that kind of girl? Yeah, yeah. I'm. I'm. I think I'm the queen of those girls. <laughs> like I, I am a leader. I, I think I'll be the one who'll be leading that clan. But uh, I too, I mean, I, but I get like very. I'm a very hard person to deal with, and I'm hungry. So yeah, it's like I need food all the time. Okay. Lastly, uh, which should have been the first question, but it's okay in no particular order. <laughs> lastly, how do you start your day? Are you somebody who wakes up and eats a lot, or somebody who goes light? Uh, so for me, I love breakfast. Breakfast. If my breakfast isn't right, it, my whole day depends on my breakfast. So I'm a person who wakes up early and has like a good wholesome breakfast. And uh, ha, my uthte. I mean, so my the thing is my breakfast is heavy. My lunch is uh, less heavier. Then my uh, evening snack is a little light, and then I always skip dinner, so I don't eat anything after seven o'clock to like get into shape. And then basically, the idea is to not eat anything before you sleep, four hours before you sleep. So go ahead. Mm-hmm. Also, you know, just uh, you know, a message bit of it is you know a lot of youngsters, a lot of youngsters, you know, just watch, read anything, and then start following those things. कि ये ऐसे करते हैं तो मैं भी करूँगा. And they kind of you know play with their health. What is it that you would want to say to them? You know, before because without any guidance, I don't think they should start off with anything. 
Yeah, no, no, that's very true. Um, and that is something that I've also done uh, back in when I was like 17, 18 years old. Um, but I think that really, really, uh, that completely changes your body and it does a lot to your health. Uh, so I suggest like you should just start dheere, dheere, dheere. see what's good for your body, what's, what's working on your body. Instead of like getting into a full crazy diet, like a keto or an intermittent, just see like dheere, dheere, just either you uh, talk to somebody or talk to your dietitian. If you don't have one, just talk to your doctor or just see dheere, dheere, what's working on your body. Like before stepping into like stepping directly into something that big, uh, I think you need to just figure what's good for your body. And uh, I think I would not say go, ask girls to not lose weight or be comfortable. If like for me, I feel that if you're not if you if you gain a little weight and you're not comfortable in it, it is completely fine to you for fine for you to like start working out or start dieting or start eating right. So like for me, like people say that but there are some times where I feel like you know a part of my body I'm not very comfortable with uh, and it's always okay to work on it and it's always uh, but just it's like you should not get into like a peer pressure where people are asking you to lose weight and if you're okay with it just then then be fine so yeah I think just eat right uh, junk food like giving up on junk food is the best thing you could do to your body so yeah it's other <laughs> also, when do we get to see you next, SRS? I'm so uh, missing those personal interviews. Yeah. Are Hana? Are any time now? Everything has started. Like we could catch up any time. Like wearing a mask. Oh. Hoping to, hoping to, you know, see you soon for your next shows interviews. Uh, probably tab tak yeah. normal hoga. And uh-huh. yeah, thank you so much for joining. Yeah, thank you so much and all the best. <laughs> Thank you. And happy Navratri. Happy Navratri. Happy Navratri. (laughs) (laughs) Bye. Bye.